battery itself is a uh, 48 volt, 20 amp out. Tire. Look at this fat tire. Mate. Look what I got when I got home. This is what was waiting for me. Truxis Explorer. They reached out to me. Oh, by the way, you like my you like my Crocs? Rob Robert Simmons, my Crocs are nicer than yours. These are Adidas. Very cool. Love these gifts. I just love these gifts. You know what time it is, right? It's unboxing time. And wanted me to have one, test ride it, and review it, and tell you what I think about it. The company name is Truxus Electric Bike 26 inch. Uh, let's put it together. Tire. Look at this fat tire. Mate, this is really big. Oh, it's a Kenda tire. Kenda. This is huge. Big. This bike is really big. Like compare it to my to my it gets all the way up to my my hip, my thigh. Bike comes to completely assembled. All you need to do is pretty much is uh, attach the front tire and the handlebars. Fender, and over there we have the pedals. Let's do that. Four millimeter Allen for, for these bolts to uh, loosen them up and put the handlebar on. And as you see, I just assembled it and just put it in place. bolt, two bolt over here, three Allen bolt, and fourth. I'm gonna put the fourth one in right now. Fender and rear fender are made of aluminum or some kind of a metal, not some flabby plastic. So this looks good, and it goes right in here. Inside, with this, and on the bottom, it's held by these two uh, supports. See these? These bolts right here, that's where this connects. Right there. Look, this is pretty impressive, okay? It even has blue Loctite on it. You see? The bolt has a uh, blue Loctite, so they like they thought of everything. That is that is a uh, uh, attention to details. Usually putting the front uh, wheel on is tricky with the with the disc. Here they have a little placeholder. properly and the brake the disc I mean the rotor on the calipers over there now let's tighten these last step so the pedals on open this up and I find they provide all the prob uh, possible tools needed for the assembly obviously with the pedals there's remember there's a right side to every this is the right side the other one is the left and these uh, bike grease and instructions just want to show you before I even proceed go ahead look at uh, the quality when I look at a bike I look at a product I want to see the manufacturing nice welds and it's a shimano shimano does oh it's even got maybe brake lights i'll see in a second it's got a 750 watt 
electrical engine, electrical motor, these huge, huge 26 uh, inch fat tires, really nice. It's got a beautiful design. I'm gonna charge it up and got everything set up. Now I'm gonna do all the fine tuning, adjust, just exactly how I like the handlebars and tighten it over here. My son just got home and he has to try them out. He's gonna be driving. Look how big he is. He's, uh, oh, my son is 5'11". So look how he fits the, this bike. Look how big, how the big the bike is compared to him. <laughs> Kids and toys, huh? He's 19 years old very soon and he's just like his dad. Enjoys uh, toys, <laughs> don't we all? Fast, huh? Boy, what do you think about the bike, Daniel? Great, it's amazing. It's cool, huh? Initial initial uh, impressions, like we literally just rode up, up and down over here. But the quality, the build quality is really nice. Actually, I'm impressed. Really I nice. think, I think it's aluminum. I don't know. The specs I'll put up over here on the screen. That's called uh, Trux Truxus. It's got a Shimano seven speed, you know, cassette like they usually use. The front is, is like one speed. This is 750 uh, watt or kilowatt or something watt motor, which is uh, the level two. I think the speed limit is 23, but don't tell anybody it goes faster. Uh, brake does not squeak. It's great. And most impressive is actually these fat tires. They're extremely beefy. And literally, there's, there is suspension in the front with uh, adjustments for, uh, I don't know, uh, compression, I mean, preload and, and rebound, whatever, whatever the... Anyway, uh, but it is moving, as I can see over here, it is moving up and down. But in the back, you literally don't feel the bumps or anything because, again, this is just initial. We've just been going over here on this cracked road pavement. But the, the tires are so beefy, they take most of the impact. And it's got a nice a rack. Yeah. Yeah, really ra uh, sturdy rack. 55 pounds max, 25 kilos. That means you can only buy a 55 pa uh, five pound steak <laughs> when you get, go to the supermarket. And look at this. It's got a, a very nice dash, very nice dash. Uh, with the, all these controls over here and look look at this there's light this dimmed it dimmed now there's a front headlight there's a uh, rear red lights and daniel do me a favor hit the brakes look at this oh my god like a motorcycle obviously i'm going to test ride it again and it's got like you know different features how many miles you win this is how many miles uh average miles per hour, average miles per hour. next button is how fast you see this is how fast daniel went 25.9 yeah he was a bit faster than me <laughs> time we rode it six minutes uh k, k calories. calories that's uh these are the uh, miles we did up till now and and so on really looks like a quality machine i'm gonna test ride it a few more days and give you a a ride review of it. See right now the assist is on zero, so I move the pedals, nothing is gonna happen. No no intervention, no assist from the engine, from like from the electrical engine, no matter what. When I go up to one, the minute I start spinning the pedals, the, rest of the pedals will only go up to 10. That's it, that's the fastest speed with an engine. I mean with the electrical motor, sorry. Obviously, when I go to two, the speed goes up to I don't know, 14, 15, and then three is a higher speed. And it goes all the way up to uh, level five, when uh, level five will take you to 28, 28 miles per hour, and it's been tested. Now, all along, no matter what speed, what uh, level you're on, five. One, two, three, four, or five. The minute you use the throttle, it immediately starts uh, going, powering up uh, the bike, and it will only go on throttle up to 20 miles per hour. 20 miles per hour on throttle only. So this bike could go 30 to 60 miles, depending how much assist you're asking for it. Obviously, if you go on this 
assist level five, you get out, you get only around 30 miles on charge. If you go the least, like on one, you get 62 miles. What powers this e-bike? There's a seven 750 watt. It's a standard electrical motor that a uh, majority of the industry of the e-bikes use. It's very powerful, sufficient, gets you up to 28 miles an hour. The battery itself is a 48 volt, 20 amp hour. That with the 750 watt uh, electrical engine can last, like I said, 30 to 60 miles. Suspension, as you see in the front, it has the forks have preload and rebound adjustment but I'm not gonna even uh, bother playing with it. The bike is designed from like five, for a rider's sizes, five, four, I think, to six, uh, six, 10, like a very big range of uh, riders. You see there's uh, obviously the seat can be adjusted. The wheels are really big, beefy fat tires, 26, uh, 26 inch, really beefy, look at them. The frame itself is aluminum, really well built. to choose this beautiful spot that I love right here by the by the river there's been rain the last few days wanted to choose this perfect spot for the to show you the Truxus 26 step over beautiful bike just look at the, the quality of the build itself look at these beefy tires 26 inch tires Kenda tires 26 by 4 Kenda fat tires this frame is all aluminum, comes with this uh, beautiful rack, very useful. Look at these Tektro brakes, hydraulic brakes, rear and front, with great controls, literally one finger control. Nice and beefy, look at the frame itself, really, really nice. Seat is very comfortable. A good looking bike, very big. It's 26, but it's like a big BMX would say. The Shimano 8-speed cassette. It's called the Acer 8. There's a 750 Bafang electrical motor engine here, 750 watt. A very big battery over here, 48 volt, 20 amp, amp hour, uh, and it's charged from here when it's on the bike itself. And you can take the battery off with a key over here that I left at home. Click this and the whole battery pack comes out. You take it home and charge it at home if you want. Controls as you see, the left throttle, one, if I put it all the way up to five, it, was, it will go 28 miles per hour, but I've gone faster. Nicely, nicely put together bike. Shocks, forks with shocks in the front, preload and rebound adjustment. Very cool bike. Very nice handling on the bike itself. I'll have a link down by the description where you can pick up that bike. I think it runs for 15, 16, 100, but they do have discount codes. They do have uh, specials. I think they're running a special right now. So go check uh, at the website. Truxus. Nice bike, very nice bike. <laughs>